So guys, for the first step, once you're on Rust, you wanna head over to Options and then click on the Screen tab. Then you wanna copy my settings. But you wanna make the FPS limit just a little bit above your monitor's refresh rate, but not at the max. Now you wanna head over to the Graphics tab and then you wanna turn everything on zero or off. But you wanna make your draw distance around 1600. Then you want to scroll down to mesh quality and you want to turn everything off there as well. But for the particle quality, you want to make it around 40 and for the object quality, you want to make it around 80. Then you want to head over to the image effects tab and you want to turn everything off. Now once you do that, you want to apply the changes and then exit out the game. Now for the second step, we're going to head over to search and type in task manager. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to close out any applications that are taking up a lot of memory. So just click on memory, which will sort by the applications that take up the highest memory. Then you want to click on it and then click on end task if you don't use it. Then you want to head over to the startup apps tab and then you want to disable all the apps so you don't want to start when your computer turns on as this also takes up memory. So for example, if I don't want Display Fusion to start when my computer turns on, I'm going to click on it and then click on disable and then the status will have changed to disabled. Now for the next step, you want to head over to search and type in graphics settings. Click on it. Now once you're on this, under add an app, you want to make sure that desktop app has been selected and then you want to click on browse. Then you want to click on this PC, then click on your C drive, then click on Program Files x86. Then you want to scroll down and then click on Steam. And then scroll down again and then click on Steam Apps, click on Common. And then you want to find your game. So in your case, you have to find Rust, but I haven't got Rust, so I'm just going to click on Display Fusion. And then you want to find the .exe file. So for me, it's DisplayFusion.exe. For you, it's going to say Rust.exe. Once you find that, you want to click on it and then click on Add. And then once it's been added, you want to click on Options, and then you want to set this to High Performance, and then click on Save. Now for the next step, I'm going to leave three links down below in the description for NVIDIA, AMD, and Intel. You want to download the latest graphics card drivers. Or you might already have your graphics card driver software. So in my case for NVIDIA, I've got GeForce Experience. Once you're on GeForce Experience, you want to click on Drivers, and then click on Check for Updates. And then you'll check if you have the latest driver. If you don't, then you can just install it. Then once you do that, depending on your software, but on GeForce Experience itself, you can go to Home, and then you can find your game, you can click on the details tab, and then you can click on the spanner, and then you can set this to performance, and then click on apply. Now for the next step, you want to head over to search and type in check for updates. Click on it. Now you want to check for updates and do the updates that your computer may have. Now once you complete all the steps in the video, you want to restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed.